What is up everybody? In this video, we're going to create a config file using YAML with this data. And then we're gonna load it into our Python project and print it out. So yep, um, if you get anything out of this video, hit the like button. Uh, if you wanna book some time with me to work on some projects, you can look in the description below. But let's go ahead and create this uh, YAML file with this data here I just copied to my, uh, my clipboard. So, the the YAML files, I don't know if you're supposed to call them YAML or what, uh, we just config that Y, should it be, it's YAML. It could be YAML or it could be YML, but in this case we want it to match up with our, the script that we have on uh, already. So config.yaml, there you go. And this is just an example database configuration, uh, port, admin, password, crappy password, never use a password with that, database name, boom. So we open the file. So here's how you open it up. You with open config.yaml uh, and then the flag r as file. Config equals yaml.safe load the file. Database config equals config, which is this file. And then the key of database, which is gonna be this whole thing. Now we can reference inside of DB config, we can kind of reference it like an array of keys and values or a dictionary where DB config represents this entire file. And then we can say, okay, what's the host? So this should print out local host and then the port 3306. We'll run it. There you go localhost in the port. So that's how you create a config file using YAML. Um, in a previous video, I showed how, the, how you create said file. It's very, very easy as well. Um, but yeah, if, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you want to book some time with me to talk a little bit about this, work on a project with you, uh, let me know. Look in the description below. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.